Give this. Uh oh, did you bring something for me? How very cool. Should I open it right now? I think I think he wants you to. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm so excited, Rhino. Here we go. I'm not even excited about the bubble wrap. Right? <laughs> Whoa! That is the coolest <laughs> ever. <laughs> it's the one. <laughs> Rhino, that's the best present ever. And awesome. a couple of bracelets. So cool. <laughs> Thank you so very much. Rhino, you want to take a quick pick with Nate? Okay, guys, so everybody knows that this past weekend was the grand opening of the Spirit Halloween flagship store 2023 in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey. I was there, and it was off the chain, off the chains of death. I was number 279 in the line, although I didn't get to go in the store until there was like, I think up in the 500s in there or something, because so many awesome fans showed up to come meet me, and I just absolutely loved it, guys. If you were there and you got to meet me, you got one of these stickers here which I made specifically for the grand opening. And on the back, I went through and I signed every single one of them. I think I gave out 1,500 of these stickers individually to people who were coming up to see me. And then I left a whole bunch in the store. If you're going looking for them, I highly doubt you're still gonna find them. They're probably gone long ago. But while I was there, so many people gave me so many little awesome gifts of appreciation, guys. I have a whole table here, my whole desk full of stuff that people gave me. I don't even know where to start, but this stuff is so awesome. And make no mistake, guys, I love each and every single one of these things just as much as the next. So let's go ahead and get started with this stuff. Now, a lot of this, I honestly don't know who it was from. I mean, at the time, everybody gave me their name, but there, there's just no way through all that chaos, I could remember everybody's name. So we're gonna go ahead and just start digging into this stuff. And I'm gonna show you guys each and everything that fans gave me while I was at the Spirit Halloween flagship grand opening. Okay guys, so what we're gonna start with here, because I'm not wearing a hat right now, and that's because I was given two hats while I was there. How cool is that? The first one is this white hat right here that says GMD Haunts. And the reason I know who this is from is because it says GMD Haunts. So thank you so very much for this awesome hat. I'm gonna try it on right now. And there you go, how cool is that? <laughs> what a cool hat. In fact, I think I'm gonna put this one on my Grim back there. We'll do that a little bit later, but we have another hat right here. And this one was from Rockafire Fan 185. It's right there on the hat. And here we go. We're going to try that one on. I need to tighten it up a little bit, but that looks pretty dang good. Thank you guys both for the hats. It's kind of hot in here, so I'm going to leave the hat off for this moment. And speaking of, let me just tell you, the hat that I was wearing, if you watched the video, you know this already, but the hat that I was wearing for the grand opening, within like half an hour of being there, it was so hot, the entire hat was soaked. Look at this, my hat, my entire hat is soaking wet and I have sweat dripping into my eye. It's burning my eye. While I was taking pictures and signing things, I'm like looking down, signing things. It was dripping. I could not believe it. I'm sorry if I dripped on anyone. <laughs> Anyways, guys, so the next thing up, and I, I honestly, I like I said, I don't remember the person's name who gave me this, but you will recognize it if you're the one who gave it to me. Someone gave me this hat that they made. Check this out. Um... I mean, it's not a real hat, it's just made to be a hat decoration. So I can't actually wear it, but let's pretend. There you go. <laughs> Very cool. Okay, let's see, man, where do we even go from here? We got pictures, we have stickers, here we go. I'll show you this right here. This is an egg that someone gave me, and that someone's name is Mr. Fright, if you can see that on the back. How funny is that? A painted 
egg that looks like a ghosty, ghouly, spooky egg. Very cool. I love it so much. All right, next up, guys, let's go through some of these um, stickers. So uh, this one's not a sticker, but I'm going to show it to you because I have stickers with it as well. And this one came from J.A. Hunts. This is just a big, like, poster that I can hang up on the wall. I really like how that is designed, the J and the A and the eyes and the hunts and the mouth. That's really cool. And he also signed it on top. So thank you so very much for that. And J.A. Hunts also gave me a couple of stickers here. So I'm going to keep those together. And let's see. Let's go through some of these other stickers, too. I have one here from Spook365 who actually was parked beside me for a little while in their RV behind me in the back parking lot when we first got there. I'll tell you what, it was kind of a mess there, guys. When I got there in my RV, um, I had to mess around for so long to get the right parking space. They had me move like three times, and the last time they had me move all the way down to the opposite end of the shopping center behind the shopping center by this abandoned steakhouse. It was absolutely insane. But anyways, let's not get off track. So like I said, that is from the Spooky Guys at Spook365. And yes, that is a YouTube channel. If you guys don't know, make sure you check them out. I don't remember who gave me this, but Someone knows that I love Garbage Pail Kids. I can see your face, but I don't remember your name. So they gave me a Haunted Hollis, and this is the Chrome Edition. If you guys know Garbage Pail Kids, Haunted Hollis is number 180. So I believe this one is actually from, like, Series 5, if I'm not mistaken. All right, next up we have a homemade sticker here which is of the Spirit Halloween movie. That is so cool right there. And again, I can see the person's face who gave me this, but there's no name on it, and I just, there's no way I could remember all these names. So again, thank you so very much. And if I don't say thank you individually, guys, for things that I'm showing you, just know that I appreciate it and thank you. <laughs> Speaking of thank you, we have this card right here. Thank you for your business. And this came from a guy who was running around with a box of body parts. And those body parts were made by the company that is on the back of this, Spellbound Effects and Art. You can find them on YouTube. You can find them on the internet. Man, let me tell you, I was holding these things and looking at them. There was like a head, a severed head that was cut up and bloody. There were arms. And it, it was crazy. They were so realistic. Make sure that you guys check out Spellbound Effects and Art. That's where this card came from. Next up, we have a couple of awesome pumpkin stickers here. And if I'm not mistaken, and I apologize if I get this wrong, but I believe these came from eCoops videos. Um, I actually stayed at the same campground as him and a whole bunch of other people, Brick Thunder and just, just a whole bunch of people, David's TV. And um, we when we went over and met them at the park, they gave me these, and uh, they are so cool. I absolutely love that design. I love that it's black and white. And I don't know where these stickers are from, but they feel like just as good a quality as the ones that I use. So I wouldn't doubt if they came from the same company. And eCoops, if you're watching this and you want to know the company that I use to get my stickers, um, let me know and I can get you a code for a discount on stickers. All right, let's see. Next up, we have a card from Joshua Harris Jush or Mr. Halloween Junkie right there. I'll hold it up so you can scan that if you want to and check out his stuff he was also at the campground with us all those guys were just the nicest guys i've ever met man they're so cool okay i have a sticker here from adventures with hayden if you want to check out his youtube channel we've got another here from adventures with hayden i got a couple of stickers here from d3's fun house that's another youtube channel if you guys want to check that one out Man, there were so many YouTubers there. And then I got this awesome sticker here from Haunted Halloween Guy. And I'll show you the back because it has his YouTube and Instagram on it here. If that'll focus in. Yep. Haunted Halloween Guy. There you go. Then I have a little 
pile of stickers here that actually came from a little guy named Rhino, who I've known for the past couple of years here. Um, he has autism, and he just loves to see me come, and he loves to water those. So we got all these stickers here. And they actually have a YouTube channel called Awesometism. And I'm going to hold that up there for you. You can go to that website there, or you can scan that little, co that little code right there. And then go check out uh, their channel. Very cool. Thank you so much, Rhino. I got something else to show you that Rhino gave me too. And I'm going to save that for last because it's just, it's unbelievable. Oh, I also got these two wristbands here that say... Awesome Tism. Very cool. Um, okay, I have another sticker here, and this was from another guy uh, that was at the campground with us. I wanted to focus in on there, and I honestly don't remember his name. And on the back, all it says is 101. <laughs> so thank you for that. Man, I met so many people this weekend, guys. I just... And I forget names as it is, but when you meet like 2,000 people in one shot, it's just insane. So, a little guy came up to me and brought me this that he made. And if you look at the top, there's popcorn in there. And if you turn it around, it says family video on it. And it's funny because I chew this kind of gum. This is actually a gum container. I can't think of what the brand of gum is. And in true Saturday night snack in a movie fashion, he used the gum container to make an awesome popcorn bucket. <laughs> so I'm going to put that in the movie room. And let's see, we have a little stack of things here, some of which I looked at and some I didn't. I saved them for this video. Why do I talk with my hands like that? <laughs> so we have this one right here. It says that that Nate guy and it has a spider on it. And then at the bottom it says Spirit Grand Opening July 2023. Thanks for the great content from Eleanor and Russell. There's a picture of them at the Haunted Mansion. I'm going to cover up their information there. And, uh, and an awesome picture of a spooky pumpkin. Very cool. It says, the great pumpkin, or maybe not, run. <laughs> okay, I got a envelope here that says, Nate, let's scare the crap out of ourselves. <laughs> oh my gosh. I love your channel, it says on the back. And then inside, did I read this yet? Oh my gosh. If I read this, I don't remember. It was so hectic there. And I looked at a lot of this stuff. Hi Nate, today is the flagship opening day. But normally I cry. Is that what that says? I did in 2017. Please help me get used to it. Oh, okay, I get it. Normally I cry because it's kind of scary in the spirit of Halloween. I got it. And I'm sad I can't watch you on my phone because I'm only allowed to have YouTube kids. <laughs> oh my gosh. And that is from Lucy. Lucy, don't worry. You will get more and more used to it. It's all spooky fun. It's just like giant toys. Um, and then we have a bunch of pictures on here. This one at the top says Hand Eating Baby. And Pinky Meow... That must be the secret keeping cat on the top there. And then we have Spirit Halloween right here. And the logo for Spirit with me saying, what are those? And then there's Lucy hanging back watching it all. Very cool, Lucy. Thank you so much. I'll tell you what, getting this kind of stuff just makes it that much more fun, guys. And you know, when I'm standing there all day long, like taking pictures and signing things, I don't get to experience the event. I didn't get to see the uh, the spinning photo booth. I didn't get to see anything that was set up like the graveyard. I didn't even get to eat a chicken sandwich from Chick-fil-A. I saw none of that stuff because I'm standing in one place taking pictures and signing autographs for all you awesome guys. And it is so much fun. I wouldn't have it any other way. Okay, so we got a couple more pictures here. Um, I know that Harley is waiting for me to open hers. And I believe this pack is from her. So we're going to save that for a minute here because there's a whole bunch of things in there. We have a picture here that somebody drew me. His name is Jordan. It's Johnny Punk. <laughs> oh my gosh. So hilarious. And then we have another one here. 
And I th I don't know if this is a name. I don't think this came, maybe it came, no. It's two different sizes. So it didn't come from the same person. But someone drew me Crouchy. And I think that says, oh yeah, right there. But I'm not sure. Too funny. You guys, if you see your stuff that you gave me, feel free to leave a comment below and let me know. Because like I said, I just don't remember everybody's name. But let's keep moving here. We have another picture here, and it is a spooky pumpkin. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love pictures like this. So hilarious. Okay, then we have another one here. It says that Nate guy on YouTube, and uh, there's ghost face, like, chasing me, I think. And I'm yelling, ah! as Ghostface is yelling, what are those? And there's a couple of pumpkins on there and headstones. That is awesome. Okay guys, we've got the stack here from Harley and then we've got one more thing in here that I'm gonna show you that came from Rhino. And, um, and you're not gonna believe it, it's totally awesome. So, this one here from Harley. Um, I wanted to make sure I remembered her name because I told her I was gonna save it and, and open this in a video. So she wrote her name Harley down there right by the pumpkin. And that says to Nate and Marion. Oh my gosh. We have... <laughs> okay. And if, if I have this correct, I'm pretty sure I got this right. I think I signed Harley's burrito baby. <laughs> I think I signed six or eight burrito babies during the day, guys. So hilarious. Okay, so here's our pictures here. One of them is the burrito baby. It says, mmm, cozy. And then we got this one, and it says, have you seen my head? And then let's see, we have, oh, that looks like the Five Nights at Freddy's guy. I've never seen Five Nights at Freddy's, but I need to. And there's a new movie coming out, so that'll be cool. And then we've got Happy Halloween. We got a ghost face there. And then we have... Something my head. What the heck does that say? I can't, I can't make it out what it says about the head there. <laughs> that is an awesome picture. Oh my gosh. Oh, half a head. Okay, so let me get to the rest of the pictures here. because and, and I could be mistaken, but I am pretty sure that all these came from Harley. So here's a picture. That must be my Hummer. Yes! You gotta love the Hummer. We have... The Marshmallow Man from Ghostbusters. <laughs> Happy Halloween. He has lights on his butt. <laughs> and here is Heckles. Oh my gosh. I love Heckles. There's this balloon. And it says, please buy balloons. Ten cents. And then the last one here is the Creepy Rising Doll. Do you want to play so creepy? Look at that. And I have the Creepy Rising doll, guys. I need to put her together very, very soon. And I just might do that tonight. That doesn't mean the video will be out tonight, but that means it'll be coming soon. Thank you, Harley, so very much. And thank you, everybody, for everything that you've given me here. It, it, it made the day so fun, as if it wasn't fun enough already. And now we're going to go ahead and open up this package here. It's in all this bubble wrap because... Um, Rhino gave this to me, and the last time Rhino gave me something, it was the Crouchy statue, which I didn't have, and it actually arrived with, like, a broken arm or something. So this is wrapped all up with this bubble wrap. Wait till you see this. You're not gonna believe it. Coolest thing ever. Okay, guys, this is awesome. Now, I'm, I'm kind of choked up here a minute because this is just so cool. I love all of this. I love all of you. Um, without you guys, I wouldn't be able to do what I do, and I enjoy it so much. And I'm glad that I can give a little bit back to you guys by doing the whole meet and greet, um, at Flagship. And it's just, it's just amazing. You guys are all amazing. So, <clears throat> I love Scary Movie. Look at this. <laughs> guys, oh my gosh, this is so cool. This is a clay mask of the killer from Scary Movie. And it is signed down here by Dave Sheridan, 
who in that movie plays Doofy and the Killer. No, I don't know about the doctor. I don't think it's that bad. I don't think it's that bad. Oh, that's perfect. That's awesome. What's up? <laughs> so this is my screen worn replica that I made. I screen printed this. Did you know that? I did a 3D print, a laser scan of my mask, and then did a 3D print, and then we made mold from it, and then we pour resin, and then I paint them with my kids and stuff. That's awesome. Yeah. So what is this YouTube show? What's this one here? Nate? We're gonna do a shout out to Nate. What's up, Nate? It's Dave Sheridan from Scary Movie. Uh, Special officer Jimmy, recording for you. Daddy, 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 daddy. Yes. I need a bell of band aid. We need a band aid bad, Nate. Help us out, everybody. We're gonna go get a band aid. <laughs> What's that? Um, I mean, this is so cool. I have a little video here that I can show you of him signing it. Um, for Rhino, and it just, it blows me away, and it just touches me. Just that all of you would do these things for me, and, and that, that you know, something like this, I mean, this was a lot of time and effort, and, um, just one of the most awesome things ever to have and to give it away. So, thank you for this, Rhino and John. Oh my gosh, I can't remember your wife's name, John. <laughs> but thank you guys for this. And thank you, every single one of you, for everything that you gave me at the event. Thank you, every single one of you, for coming out to meet me at the event. I know there was a couple people that I missed. <sighs> and uh, I'm sorry for that. I tried to stick around long enough that I would not miss anybody. Um, I was in the store about one o'clock. I was absolutely beat, guys. I was so tired. I was exhausted. I was sunburned. My sides were cramping. Hadn't had anything to eat. I was like slugging down water and Gatorade just to try to get the cramps to go away. And at the same time, I was trying to make a video and get pictures with people and sign things. And I had like a hundred kids swarming around following me like the Pied Piper of Hamlin. And I had to jet out the door and get to the truck and just relax in the air for a little bit. And when I left the building, like, everybody outside in the line erupted. It was insane. And I ended up stopping and getting probably 20 more pictures before I could actually get to the truck. And I got to the truck. I pulled these curtains, turned on the air, and I just kicked back in there for probably... Oh, 20 minutes or a half an hour or something. I was just, I was beat. I was dead. And I was like, you know what? I do not want to leave anybody disappointed. Um, people drove halfway across the earth to get here. I know that for a fact because I did it myself. <laughs> and anybody who drove that far or even around the corner to see me and knew that I was going to be there and have that chance to see me, I really wanted to offer that and satisfy that because I, I just cannot tell you how thankful I am that you guys love these videos, love what I do, and, and that you watch this stuff all the time. So we circled around to the back. Um, I climbed out of the truck and I went under that gigantic white tent they had back there and I hung out for another hour, a little bit more than an hour and and just signed and took pictures with everybody who showed up and my son went around to the parking lot and to the line and everything and said, "Hey, if you want to see that Nate guy, he's back here under the tent because I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss anybody." And I think there was only like two people who said that um that they were there and I missed them. So, <sighs> Guys, thank you so much. I'm still just exhausted thinking about it. And it is just the beginning of the season. We are going to have such an awesome Halloween season, guys. All the Spirit Halloween videos are going right here on this channel. And do not forget, I have a second Halloween channel called That Nate Guy on Halloween, where I'm posting everything but Spirit Halloween. In fact, there might even be a little bit of Spirit Halloween on there. So make sure you jump over there and subscribe. And guys, I'm going to give you more Halloween than you can ever handle. <laughs>